I am swapping the camera around because you don't want to talk to me. We want to talk to Rodrigo. Hi. Hi. So Rodrigo, say your name and how old you are and where you're from. I'm Rodrigo. I'm 15 years old and I'm from College Park, And are you a tennis player? Yeah, I am a tennis player. And what are you doing here at the Open this week? Um, I just want to watch the match and one of my friends helped me get a pass, so I want to make the best of it before the school starts. So when I introduced myself and told you what I do and I said that I do things to help parents, you said, oh, parents need that. Yeah, what, do you, what do you mean by that? Well, I feel like parents get really, they get really into the tennis because they really want to see their child succeed and I understand that they want to see us do well and be happy, but sometimes they like cross the line. Like, they get involved too much. Like, I've seen parents yell at a child that's not theirs because of, like, bad calls or, you know, just, like, playing out, you know, the, the tension of a match. Like, they'll yell at a kid that's not theirs, and I think that's wrong because, you know, we're still kids. There's a lot of overstepping. And so if you could send one message to all the tennis parents out there as the kid of a tennis parent, what would you say? Um, we understand that you love us and you do your best to see us succeed and you pay and I know that tennis is an expensive sport and you gotta pay for all of that and you have to drive us and we appreciate that and we love you for that but sometimes you know it's best to you know be positive and you know just stick to talking to us. We don't wanna make other people uncomfortable and you know like what happens at home is and I'll bring it out to the tennis court in front of everyone because you know it's kind of embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Well, thank you for sharing yeah. your thoughts and have fun this week. Yeah, thank you. All right.